In this video, I'll show you how to hide or delete app purchases on your iPhone. If you find this guide useful, please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please consider going down below and leaving a like. And let's get right into this. The first thing you need to do is go and open up the App Store. So go and tap on App Store like so. Then what you need to do is go to the account settings in the App Store. To do that, just come to any of the pages on the App Store and then go to the top right and go and tap on your profile picture. I've personally gone and set a profile picture to sort of an emoji, but it's likely that yours is just going to be blank, so go and tap on it like so in the top right. Then what you need to do is go and tap on purchased in here as well, and don't worry, free games are also going to be in here as well, it's all included. If you've got family sharing turned on, you'll need to tap on my purchases, otherwise you'll get taken straight to this page here. And now as you can see, you can see all of the apps which I've gone and downloaded. You can keep scrolling down and also go and click on not on this iPhone as well to go and see more apps. But if you want to go and hide one, for example, I want to go and hide this app here, the DuckDuckGo browser. So I'm going to swipe across like so, and then go and tap on hide. And that's literally it. It's now been removed from this list and people can't go and find it. If I go and tap on search and search for it as well, it's still not going to come up, which is fantastic. And if you're wondering if it's possible to go and view these hidden apps, well, yes, there is a way. All you need to do is go and open up your settings like so, then go right to the top and go and tap on your name. And below that will say Apple ID, iCloud, Media and Purchases, tap here. Then what you need to do is just tap on Media and Purchases like so, and then go and tap on View Account and it's gonna take a moment to load. And then all you need to do is scroll down this page here, and as you can see, we've got this option for hidden purchases. And so you can go to that page there and just go and look at the hidden purchases and also go and unhide them as well. If you guys found this useful, please leave a like, peace.